Sealock really got off the ground after a group of mountain bikers had got together at Red Eye to meet about the potential of having gravity trails at Rib Mountain. That didn't happen, but what we realized is that we needed a voice in the community to represent our sport and to be able to respond and to promote opportunities like Rib. Shortly after, we formed Seawalk and it grew faster than we could imagine. I mean, Ember Ride Center came, the idea came from Hansi Johnson, who was our regional director at the time with Imba. Outside of Nine Mile and Rib Mountain, we weren't thinking bigger than that. And you know, Hansi came in and made us think outside the box. Imba Trail Solutions, we hired to bring in to, to vet out our plan, help us kind of decipher which areas had the most potential. We started work at Nine Mile in like 2013. Um, did about a thousand, over a thousand hours of volunteer work to rebuild the trail system, interlink it, and get signage up. And we continue to do work to this day. We um, work closely with Epic Trail Design, Nick Wiersba, to bring all kinds of trail improvements to Nine Mile. Snow biking was really gaining popularity um, in the Northwoods, Hayward, Marquette area. And Seawalk thought it might be a good idea to explore our own trail system here in the Wausau area. We approached the county and uh, they gave us the green light for Sunnyvale, uh, which was Seawalk's first uh, snow bike trail system. Sylvan was actually a little bit of an afterthought. Um, didn't take it real seriously when initial planning started until Aaron Rodgers, and him, he was with Imba Trail Solutions at the time, came in and really said, this is, this is the place to start. This'll, this is where you put your bike park. It'll make a big impact. Sylvan took about four years from inception to final, final build. Now we have a, an outer loop um, with three progressive jump lines. Yeah, since opening, we've had a wide variety of age groups using the pump track in the skill area. Um, kids on kick bikes, all the way up to regular size pedal bikes. in my first off-road triathlon and thought I knew how to mountain bike and after the event realized that I knew nothing about mountain biking. At that point I contacted Jan, the president of Seawalk at that time, to see if they would support me in bringing the first women's mountain bike clinic to Wausau. In 2017 we had our first Seawalk women's mountain bike clinic Had 41 women participate in that event.
simultaneously while Sylvan was being planned and conceptualized, we were also working with Melissa Johnson, the director of the Marathon County Solid Waste Department, to conceptualize a trail system on the Ringel landfill area. After Sylvan was completed, we began construction right away at Ringel. The first 2.5 miles of trail cost about $100,000 and were funded um, with the incredible support of our local foundations. In 2018, we brought back the Youth Ride program in conjunction with Wassa United Ride, using their coaches as ride leaders and assistants. Since 2018, we've had anywhere from 50 to 70 kids out on bikes, which is our primary mission, is just getting more kids on mountain bikes. I think what I'm most proud of is the local support for mountain biking we have here in central Wisconsin. What continues to amaze and impress me the most is the amount of investment that local foundations and businesses have given to Seawalk. Over the last 10 years, Seawalk has raised over a half a million dollars that go directly into building mountain bike trails. Sylvan Hill Mountain Bike Park really put Seawalk on the map and legitimized us as a community organization. As soon as local foundations saw Seawalk's plan for Sylvan Hill Mountain Bike Park, they, they realized our vision. They saw it was possible and it was easy for them to fund such a unique outdoor recreation opportunity for our community. Mountain biking has evolved over the past 10 years and riders are looking for a quality trail experience. Mountain bike trail and design has evolved and Seawalk is keeping up with the times by hiring professional trail builders to build out Sylvan Hill, Ringle Trails, so that we are building the best mountain bike experience we can in central Wisconsin. Seawalk's vision is to continue to create new progressive trail systems so that riders of all ages and abilities can enjoy. Seawalk is proud of all of the trails we've built over the years, but what we're most proud of is the sense of community we've developed. It's really our members that that are the most important part of our club. They are, they are the lifeblood. They're the blood, sweat, and tears of our operation. We're fortunate enough to have over 300 members who are willing to not only ride our trails, but give back, promote the sport, rep Seawalk on their, on their jerseys and on their helmets. Over the years, our volunteers have put in thousands of hours of sweat equity, cleaning trail, building trail, making a better riding experience for people all over the state. We're super proud of the improvements we've done at Nine Mile, the build-outs of Sylvan Hill Mountain Bike Park and Ringle Trails, but we're just getting started.